Hi, I'm Maria Galloway, the owner of PM Gallery, and today we're talking about the work of Ruth Apter, who's a ceramics artist from Washington State. She does a lot of wonderful horses, and that's what first attracted me to her work. We have these pieces here, the running horses, and they are just lovely. They have uh, these crimped copper wires that represent the mane and the tail. This is a copper glaze as well. This one I love. It's a pit fire glaze. So it's got a lot of personality to it, a lot of variation because of the, the uh, firing process. We also have others in that same glaze like this uh, lovely buffalo. So each one is going to be very different because of the randomness of the firing process. She does other horses that are um, inspired by the ancient world. This one is called Ancient Horse. It's also a copper glaze. Got a lot of texture, a little bit of shiny bits, and then a lot of um, very coarse bits. And he looks like a cave painting. This is the Phoenix Horse, which uh, this is also the pit-fired style, and it's based on a Phoenician horse, prehistoric design. And we also have it in the uh, copper. And uh, they're just very pleasing shape. And then this is the uh, Sweetbriar horse, and he's got his nose down. I think he's probably facing into the wind because he's a very stoic horse. And then the workhorse, who's very solid. And then she does others like uh, the seal, who's got a salmon. We've got an otter lying on his back. And fun ones like the love bunny and bear hug, who's very sweet. And here's a polar bear with uh, a salmon on his side. This is Raku fired. You can tell by the crackling in the glaze. That's where the smoke gets in and gives it texture. And there again, no two are going to be alike. So thank you very much for this today's installment. Ruth Apter, Washington State pottery artist. 100 Horses is her studio name. We'll see you next time. Thanks.